Mr. Cumberbatch, uh, we were told something very adorable by Jane Campkin. She said that um, the biggest problem she has is the head. And so is the what, sorry? The, is the head. The head is the hardest to manage. The uh, head is the hardest to manage. manage okay. uh, as a director. Okay. So she had you rehearsing for three weeks to get body memories, to make you fit, to make you tan, to make you dirty. Yeah. And she made you waltz with the rest of the guys. Is that yeah. true? Yeah. 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 Did you have to teach them how to waltz? No. No? No. No, I think Jesse's probably got a better step than me. He's, <laughs> he's a musician and um, he's also somebody who grew up on a ranch in Texas. So he was well ahead of the game and he... Uh, he was wonderful. I mean, he is just such an exceptionally brilliant actor. He grounds everything he does in such a truth and naturalism. And I, 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 you know, the minute I read the book, the minute I read the script, I was like, there's only one actor that can play my brother, it's, it's him. And when Kirsten was then talked of for Rose, I was like, of course, it's perfect, it's absolutely perfect. And Cody was a discovery for me. I mean, I'd seen The Road, I'd seen Let the Right One In, both versions, but his American version. and. Um, Thought he was a fantastic actor but I'd forgotten what he looked like I mean, he's changed a lot since he first came into this industry and he it gave me chills when I first saw him after a costume fitting I saw him walk in as Peter I was just blown away so yeah.